Yeah, we are uh, at uh, the booth of Bronner Electronic. Uh, we're the first time at the iTech here in Rotterdam, uh, showing our uh, new product, the VR Motion uh, 200. It's a very small platform for uh, different training purposes. You could use it uh, for aircrafts, as you have the setup here now. Uh, helicopters, ground vehicles, um, all kind of uh, different purposes. What, whatever you like, you could build it up on the platform. I think uh, if, you, if you have joint trainings, for example, like refueling, air refueling, could be quite nice. So you have the big uh, full flight simulator where the whole crew is sitting in there, but you have uh, little planes like uh, in, in this platform, three or four, refueling one after each other. Um, try to, to aim at the, at the, uh, at the, at the hook. Um, uh, search and rescue missions for helicopters could be quite interesting. Uh, you have the uh, one pilot sitting there in, in the cockpit with the VR goggles. Another pers person next to it is probably the ground uh, person that needs to grip a, uh, grab the hook. Um, as well, landing on a, on a boat. So, such kind of things, I think procedures you have to do several times. Um, less on instrumentation, but bad visibility. Um, um, moving, moving objects, and somehow to, to get those things together, I think would make the most uh, out of it as a training effect. As I said, we uh, are broadcasting this uh, VR Motion 200 now the first time uh, in, 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 in our company's history. We have a lot of control loadings. We normally um, sell to sim builders, and this is now our own uh, first sim. Uh, yeah, the, the aim is now to, to bring it to market, um, to, to show people its abilities. And uh, next steps, um, the, the, the motion queuing uh, is, is very nice, so we don't need to improve that very much anymore, so people don't get sick. Uh, one more uh, improvement we are working on is now, of course, the hand tracking, so that you really could uh, push buttons and uh, turn knobs and stuff like that. And, uh, we are working on that uh, with quite high pressure, but it's going to be really nice actually.